Ian, this is uh, almost breaking news about Best Buy ending their gamers uh, club program to get what was it twenty percent off of uh, of games? So, somewhat similar, pre-orders. Or, yes, almost somewhat similar to Amazon Prime having that for new games, but for Amazon Prime, you had I think you had up to like the game being out for like a couple of weeks to get twenty percent off, something like that. I believe it was the last time I bought it, a Mario Kart Eight Deluxe. So they're shutting down Best Buy, is shutting down their um, their their gamers club program. Uh, if it was first uh, in a leaked memo, but then they announced, it, yeah, we're just going to shut it down. Current customers can still receive their uh, gamers club unlocked benefits until their subscription expires, but no new customers will be able to subscribe. So this is going to wind down. Sounds like uh, this year or two. Uh, discounts on nearly all games sold at Best Buy. Two, a two-year GCU membership used to cost 30 bucks, but it offered 20% off all new games and pre-orders. Members also saved 10% off used games and received an extra 10% in trading credit. I have no idea how well the Best Buy trade-in program went. I haven't stepped into a Best Buy in probably five years, six years. I have no idea. Uh, the I've only, I go into a Best Buy once in a blue moon, and I'll quickly spin down the video game aisle um it's usually to get we we almost never go there with any purpose in mind it's just we're next to one so oh i need a power cable or something like that um but i the the video game section in the ones near here especially the one out by that mission valley mall Mm -hmm. the video game section is always barren and i don't recall ever seeing any used video games (laughs) so i've always wondered where they store the used games maybe it just never really took off in san diego um so i'm guessing if you have the membership it's still going to be good until it runs out. yes it is so but for the most part then unless you enroll before the last day in two years from now there's no no one gonna be left probably the majority won't won't be there a year from now yeah they didn't do any warning on it it was just we're not doing it anymore so no one could rush out and and do it again which to me says they were eating a ton of money on it and of course they were because there's really almost no markup whatsoever on new video games so so pat man 20 percent off of a 60 dollars game is 48 bucks 12 dollars off so at 48 dollars are they even breaking even best buy on wholesale of these games <laughs> do you want to wait until you finish your bar before we keep going no i don't i'm starving well that's why i said do you want to wait until you finish your bar you're chewing into my ear um i would imagine that even a store gets a huge discount on a on a game that they get for brand new they're maybe making let's see this is the cheapest we would ever yeah i mean 48 bucks would be about break break even absolute <laughs> break even if you're getting a good deal on that game maybe they're making like three bucks on that game because 48 was if we were lucky we would get a game in for 48 most of the time it'd be like 55 and then you factor in shipping and all that stuff so that couldn't have been you know anything good for them um so they probably just <clears throat> figured well these people are, are not really buying anything else here so it's not even a loss leader anymore it's just we're just losing money right doing this they're not coming in and buying a controller they're not gonna buy uh i don't know best buy points even i don't like they probably figured this will get people into the door to buy other stuff but no they're just gonna people are probably signing up for this program and just buying video games yeah and from what i understand you could use it online which is an even worse thing lost leaders don't work if you don't walk into a store yes you have i mean you have to walk into a store for that sort of thing to work Lost leaders, you walk in, you buy something that's cheaper, that's usually more expensive for the store, and then you walk around and you grab a bunch of other things that they actually make money on. There's nothing to walk around and look at in an online store. If you're even remotely disciplined, you go on, you buy your cheap video game, and you log back off, and that's it. Just so, just so people know what a loss leader is, because it's weird. I know the term from working in a gro- grocery store. I Yeah, same. Well, not a grocery store from restaurants and shit like that. What a loss leader is, it means it's the, the, the first thing that entices you to, to get into the store to buy. And the store is usually taking a loss on it. But then while you're in the store, you're going to buy something else that turns a profit. So, for example, you know, it's like having, I don't know, uh, meat on sale in a supermarket. But you're still going to buy eggs and cheese and milk. And that's where the profit comes in. Yeah. So that's a loss leader. Something that leads the rest of the buying, I guess. Yeah. It's the Pied Piper that gets you into the uh, the supermarket. It's the it's a discount Pied Piper. Yes, <laughs> and then you're taking for a ride buying eggs or or 
They'll be the cheese. You get what we're saying. Yeah. <laughs> so, right, without Wikipedia, it, that's what a loss leader is. Um. So, what what's concerning about this? Is, this does not surprise me. Um. But I think this is a fairly. This could indicate that perhaps we might see this stop with Amazon. Oh, that'd be bad for me. <laughs> It'd be bad for me too. Although I don't really, I, honestly, I don't take advantage of it. And Prime just raised their, their 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 twenty bucks up to ninety nine to one twenty a year, which is still a great deal. They can raise it two hundred dollars, probably still be a good deal. Yeah, it's it's still a good deal. Um, but with so Amazon started that, and then Best Buy did it to compete, and Best Buy can't handle it, so they dropped. Um, I'm wondering if that's enough to show Amazon that, okay, we did it. We had someone try to compete with it. They couldn't hang. Do we really need to do this anymore? Sure. We've already bled them dry in essence from this because Amazon can take the hit more than Best Buy can. Right. So they're like, okay, maybe we'll get rid of it. And you're right. They, they can probably get rid of it whenever they want. You know, and yeah. who, what are you going to do? There's nowhere else to go to get the discount anymore. You know? So it, that's it, a hefty 20% off is hefty off of something that's brand new. That's a hefty discount. Yeah, it is. 20%. Like 10% yeah, so is even like you don't see 10% off new stuff a lot of times. 20% is a chunk. Yeah. Um, the, the memo, the internal memo that leaked said, for a variety of reasons, yeah, we decided that our Gamers Club programs will not be accepting new members. For one reason. Variety. Money. Current members will continue to receive their benefits. Yeah, because that's probably legal. You have to do that. We encourage everyone else to use our My Best Buy membership to receive perks and blah, blah. But um, let's see. But they, got, they said they got to remove all signage. Everything's got to be removed from the sales floor and front lanes immediately. Like, you know, yeah. this is done. This is just, don't remind people that they have it. And yep. don't get anyone new. Because we're losing tons of money on this. Man. I can't, I, the, the percentage of people that probably buy their games from Best Buy that have this probably killed all the profit from it. It has to be, even if like, if you figure if there's not much margin to begin with for profit, if even 20%, 25% of the people had this program and used it for new games, that killed the profit. Like mm -hmm. it was just done. Oh yeah. Or, or it might have been worse than that. Maybe it's half. Because you know, gamers are, are know about this stuff. They find out. And who's going to walk into a Best Buy randomly to buy a video game? Why don't you walk into a, a GameStop instead or a Target or, you know, or a Walmart? Like Best Buy is sort of fringy now in terms of why you walk in there for yeah that circus city exists only almost only online now so best buy is probably not doing that well either yeah it's like think. all my used stuff i get from luna and then I, the last few new games i've purchased have actually been from target just because i find myself in target for other things and you get it and you can get the target credit card or, you, or debit card you get five percent off all your purchases yeah I didn't even know so that. even that's a discount that's i got that when i got my switch and i saved like what was that 30 the pat map it's like fucking 15, 20 bucks. So, and there you go. When I bought my uh, Mario Kart uh, 8 Deluxe, I think. That's when it came out. That's when they had it stocked. Good old Switch. You can buy it anywhere now. <laughs> so, anything else to add? You still think Amazon's going to be done with this too? Be like, oh, well, we killed them off. We're going to. We'll see. I mean, they started it on their own as a way to entice people into um, Prime. And they may keep it. I mean, honestly, it's a great perk of having Prime, and you pay 120 a year for Prime. Granted, you get the video, and now you get music, and you get the delivery. But it's okay. It's a, it's a big thing. Oh, so Amazon. I was right. It used to be two weeks after a game's launch. Now it's just pre-orders. They changed that. Yeah, I, that okay. that I noticed. So maybe okay. they'll just stay with that. Because that's interesting. Once it's out, still having 20% off. That's... Yeah, they haven't. Yeah, they got rid of that pretty quickly. Because they probably realized, wow, we're, we're, we're taking a hit here, oh, too. They, they were Not that it. Amazon it, is, it can, cannot just buy and sell all of us, but, you know, uh, Jeff Bezos is the richest man in the world now. He's worth the most, at least. He's worth, like, what is it, $700 billion or something ridiculous? Jesus. Again, it's not liquid cash, though, but still. Anyway, so, um, yeah, we'll see if we get another. What, 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 what's the program from GameStop you get for percentage off? What do you get? Do you get like a free towel when you walk in? What, 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 what do they offer? <laughs> GameStop towel, power to the players. <laughs> get a beanie. What, what, do, what do they give you there? Yeah, nothing. They give you nothing? 